Welcome to this video from Camprig Communications on how to create a print ready PDF file from Adobe InDesign with bleeds and trims. Okay, first we need to open our InDesign file. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is check that this document actually has bleeds. If I just click here and go to normal view. Okay, the pink line you can see going around this document is the trim marks. So if I went back, so if it didn't have bleed, your document would look something like this. Okay, and the problem you've got is when this job is printed and it goes to the guillotine, if the guillotine doesn't cut straight along this edge, you're going to get a little bit of white showing. So what you have to do is you have to make sure your document has bleed. So we'll just extend everything out. Um, you need a minimum of three millimeters over the edge for your bleed and this will then allow enough room for the guillotine operator to have a nice clean cut all the way around your document without having any white show. I'll just show you what I mean by that. If I just bring that down like so and I go back to the preview mode if the guillotine operator or the guillotine hasn't quite cut your file or your printed document correctly you'll get a little white line like this along the top so what we need to do is make sure if you've got color or images to, to the edge of the paper, you have to make sure it comes over the edge by 3 mil, which we call bleed. Okay, now we've done that, make sure that document's got bleed, go to file, down to Adobe PDF presets, and what we need and what we require here at Camprint is high quality print, select that. I'm going to save this on my desktop. I'll just call this brochure. Save that. Okay. Now, Adobe PDF preset, like we selected before, make sure it's high quality print. So we have that selected. And you'll find most of the default settings are going to be pretty spot on in InDesign. So we'll just go down to compression, make sure we've got 300 pixels per inch, 300 per inch and 1200 pixels per inch for black only and this is the important bit we need marks and bleeds so if you can select under marks crop marks and that gives us a guide on where these trims actually are I'll show you this on the PDF file once it's created and then down to bleed and as I said before we need a minimum of three five would be really good but three's just as good really. Um, then export okay, and you'll see uh, in InDesign you can see the progress of the background task just up here so once that stops moving you know your PDF will be created depending on the size of your document obviously it depends on how long that file takes to create Okay, now that's stopped, I'll just close this document. I won't save it. I'll close this window, and you'll notice on your desktop you'll have a brochure PDF file. I'll just open that just to check that the trim marks, which I mentioned before, are in place, and you have in fact bleed all the way around the edges. And that now is perfect to send on to us here at Camprint. If you'd like to watch more videos which Camprint have produced, if you just go to the Camprint website, camprint.com.au and select the YouTube link at the top, 
from here you'll be directed to our cam print channel. Thanks for watching, goodbye.